I'm Alison Fletcher and I'm an inspector with the RSPCA and I'm the um, coordinator for the RSPCA Pet Food Bank Partnership which is a new scheme that started in 2020 and its primary aim is to make sure that there's a regular supply of pet food to the food bank organisations so that families that are suffering financial crisis can always have access to food so they can feed their pets. So nobody should have to be in a position where they have to make decisions whether they, whether they feed their animals or they feed themselves or whether they have to consider rehoming a really loved family pet because they're suffering in times of financial crisis. We're already seeing um, demand for rehoming soaring. Our animal centres are telling me that they're getting increased calls every day of people wanting to um, sign up their animals for rehoming. Certainly when you look at the calls that have been coming into our animal helpline, the reasons why people may be looking to give up their pets are potentially financial, um, and maybe concerns around housing situations. My name is Nathan and I'm the uh, food bank manager here at Burnley Community Food Bank. Uh, so basically we're the main hub in Burnley, so we support um, everyone with food parcels really, but we're also a distribution centre, so we support other charities as well. So, But the, the pet food is, a, is obviously a, a really big addition for us, because a lot of people are choosing between feeding the pets and feeding themselves. So the partnership with, with RSPCA, people can get free pet food, because it, it's so expensive nowadays, like everything. We had somebody who called for a food parcel the other week um, and said oh, I don't need a lot of food but I really need pet food because it's costing me dogs on a special diet, right. costing the fortune so he was buying food for the dog and not getting food for himself so I said look we'll, we'll supply it, if you're you, can you afford food, he says I can but I just can't afford to, to feed the dog yeah. so he's been feeding the dog with his food. I'm Julie Klaus and I'm the coordinator of Pebble and Churches Together Food Bank. For people who are already struggling, the, the cost of living crisis just adds one more stress to life. I mean, we've been up for 10 years and we've been seeing people you know, suffering from relationship breakdown, homelessness, benefit problems, waiting for appeals, and all those things are still happening. And on top of that, they have the cost of living crisis, they've got the recent increase in fuel duty. Uh, lucky, yeah, she's at home. I've had her eight years. Yeah, she means a lot to me. Also, she sleeps on my bed at night when it's winter. <laughs> oh, I keep her well fed. Yeah, food bank for you, for you. Uh, I've been coming to the party, to the food bank, and the people are all right, volunteers. Yeah, I get on with them. I even help them out at cot when they've been shopping out at cards. Please, if you can, donate to the RSPCA Pet Food Bank Partnership. You can do this by visiting the RSPCA website or contact one of our local RSPCA branches.